Okay guys, a real quick video here on just showing you how to get the uh, videos that you shoot with Psycorder and iPhone Video Recorder off your iPhone. So you can get them on your computer, transfer them, do what you do with them. Uh, first thing you want to do is get a program called iFunbox. You can get it from i-funbox.com or you can also get it from freedomforiphone.com. Go to the downloads page, which is where I'm at, and you will see... Uh, iPhone box right under there underneath the uh, advertisement. So go ahead and go to Send Space and download that. We'll just go through the, the setup because it's real quick. That way you guys can see what it looks like. Uh, the download link will load in a second. Go ahead and click the blue link when it downloads. Uh, I'm going to choose to save, not open, because I want to use the file later. So we'll save it. Save it to the desktop is where I always put mine. Up there, see it say desktop. I always save it to desktop because I'll be losing stuff if I don't uh, save it to desktop. All right, so we're gonna save it and let's close some of these out. All right, so we got our iPhone box right there, and we're just gonna open that up, and then we see iPhoneBox.exe but I don't see the icon so what you need to do is if you're on Vista or XP you most likely need to unblock that file so I'm gonna right click it go to properties and if you look closely down there on the bottom right you'll see that it says uh, unblock see that right there so click unblock then apply and then OK and then that should give us a little bit more access so we can actually use the dang program. Alright, so we're gonna double click that. We see iPhone box. Double click that. And this is what we see. So, what you're gonna see there is obviously my phone up there on the right. And then um, over here on the left you'll see your files and folders that are in the iPhone. Click the little T and then there's a couple other folders up there that really aren't important for right now but obviously you guys see what they are. What we're interested in is the raw file system. So we're gonna click on raw file system and then boom there's all the folders that are inside your iPhone. Now where we're going is to the user media folder so we're going to click on user right here. I don't know if you guys can see that very clearly, but user, boom. So we'll click on the side right there, user, and then media, again on the side. And then we see some more choices pop up right there. And you see two that are probably sticking right out right now that you're like, oh, okay, that's where my videos are. So you have videos from Sidequarter <coughs> in the videos folder. So if we click on videos, and then we go back here and look you will see that you have yourself the movies that you shot so you're wondering okay how do I get those from my iPhone to my computer well it's pretty easy all you have to do is select one of those movies just by uh, clicking on it so it's highlighted in blue and then if you look up above it boom copy to PC so select copy to PC and then you'll see the box that pops up what it's asking you right now is where do you want to save this copy of the movie um, I always go up here and choose desktop because uh, like I said I lose stuff or I can't remember where it is so I always choose desktop so we'll save it to the desktop all you have to do is click on save and that little flash you saw back here that was the movie being transferred which is right there so, we'll show you real quick how to get the videos off that you shoot with Video Recorder 3 or 3G. They're on the same spot. But all you have to do is click the folder right down there that says iPhone Video Recorder. And once you do that, you'll just want to look up, back up there and uh, select whatever movie it is that you want to transfer or video, whatever you want to call it. So boom, again it says movie, and then just click that. You're gonna go up here, 
to copy to PC and select a place to save it. Now obviously you can save it wherever you want but uh, all you gotta do at this point is click on save and there it goes, saving it and then that's how you do it guys, pretty simple. Uh, last thing I'll mention just real quick is see right there where it says device safe removal make sure you click that button and then your iPhone so it removes it safely. Um, that's about it guys, that's pretty straightforward. Um, iFunbox also will let you delete files too, so if after you transfer those to your uh, computer, if you want to delete them, uh, you just right click the video files or the movie files and then select delete and that's pretty much that. If you guys have any questions, let me know.